we do have that flash flood watch in place across portions of southern Nevada. That is due to the thunderstorm threat that does linger through tonight and then into the next couple of days. With any of these thunderstorms that develop, they have the potential to really pack a punch with that really heavy rain, and they've been staying pretty stationary without a lot of driving force, which means it can dump the rain in one spot, which does add in that flood threat. Right now, the only flash flood warning we have is here in Mojave County near Kingman with this thunderstorm that's finally starting to die off, but it's also starting to cross Highway 93, and so that means right near Boulder City. We're starting to see that rain ramp up. We are seeing that heavy rain, a little bit of the lightning east of Highway 93, but close enough to Boulder City will want to head indoors. So that's what I'm watching uh, in terms of uh, of close to home here. We also have some thunderstorms firing up over Mount Charleston, staying stationary, but we are seeing the lightning and heavy rain there. If those start transitioning a little further east, maybe we could pick up some rain in Summerlin, but right now that's not happening. So dry in the valley, but our higher elevations are seeing the rain. We'll continue to see this spotty rain and thunderstorm chance off and on into this evening. It looks like the overnight hours will quiet down a little bit more, and then tomorrow, same story. We'll get that 20 to 30 percent thunderstorm threat working in, especially during the afternoon and evening hours, and especially especially for our higher elevations, but a few showers are going to be possible in the valley. So do keep those umbrellas close by. It's going to be the locally heavy rain, the gusty winds and the lightning. Those are our primary threats, but wind speed not too impressive today. We haven't really seen that uh, thunderstorm outflow pick up for the valley and temperatures feeling good. 100 right now in Las Vegas, 98 in McCarran, 98, uh, 97 in North Las Vegas. So this is capped cooler than where we typically see temperatures this time of year, and that will continue tomorrow. Tonight we will drop into the 80s with mostly cloudy skies. Tomorrow will stay in the upper 90s, low 100s, depending on where you're at, and we will see that 20 to 30 percent thunderstorm chance work in tomorrow afternoon and evening, similar to what we saw today. Friday repeat performance and then our pattern will flip back to hot and dry by this weekend and check out that temperature climb low 100s tomorrow. We're back near 110 by Saturday.